I think the best advice that my oncologist told me was, you know, it seems like that day three is when you're going to hit that brick wall and, and um, you're really down and out. For me, it was day four. But then as soon as I hit it, literally like the next day, I'd start to feel better and better. And when, when I felt like I had bounced back, the oncologist said, you know, it's very important for you to maintain your strength, you know. And he knew I, I was a big time runner and, and into exercise and I did like you try to eat as healthy as I could. Um, and so he said, when you had the opportunity to go, not, not so much for a run, but like just get out there and walk and get that, that blood flowing, Absolutely. it's only going to make you stronger for the next one because you just got to keep, you know, fighting, fighting back as everything's going through you. So that's what I did. And, um, but by, by the 6-1, I mean, I was pretty beaten up, but um, I was very happy that it was over and moving on to the next step. Yeah. Well, let me I, again what, let, let, let let me jump in for a second. Lisa, you make a really important point. Stay healthy during all of these treatment phases for the, those who are newly diagnosed. Keep up your exercise program. Yes, there are going to be days when it's almost impossible to do it, but you do need to keep up with your exercise. Even if as you said it was just simply walking. Mm -hmm. Uh in in addition uh, you want to eat as healthy as you can. As Anne Marie said, one day was a Ritz Crackers day. Fine. But right. just keep the food going. Keep moving. Keep putting one foot in front of the other. And the analogy that I use, ladies, is this is like running the marathon. And there's a couple heartbreak hills thrown in there. And there are days that are better than others, but there is light at the end of the tunnel. So both of you have come up with really very important, practical, critical issues here. So thank you for doing that. Hi, I'm Dr. Jay Harness, and I want to share with you important information that I believe that every newly diagnosed patient with breast cancer needs to know. I'm a breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. I am a breast cancer survivor. And I want every woman to know about personalized breast cancer treatment and the genomic test. A test that helps guide a woman and her doctor to the best treatment options for her. Pass it on.